So Joe Rogan has another detractor who's trying to get him canceled. I, I never quite understood this, why people want to cancel Joe Rogan. All he does is he talks to people. Like literally, like his job is he gets people on his podcast and he has long form conversations with them. And people freak out about it. They're like, why is Joe spreading misinformation? I mean, when he got the sickness that shall not be spoken of, he basically was like, hey, this is what my doctor told me to take. And I took it. And then the whole world freaked out. People have said all kinds of crazy stuff about him. And, and the, give it to Joe. Give him credit, man. He's just like, whatever, dude. I just, I just talk to people. <laughs> and that's it. He's willing to talk to just about anybody. But Neil Young, you know, the hippie from the early days of hippie music. He had that song, Southern Man, where he essentially disparaged people from the south but anyhow he had an issue with it and he he made his ultimatum said hey spotify you guys are like tech leftist hippies like me man so i tell you what if you if you ain't gonna get rid of that joe rogan i'm gonna take my music down and i actually think neil young had kind of an inflated sense of who he was and in his mind, he thought he was this big rock star like he used to be in the you know, 1970s. He's not. <laughs> he is not, unfortunately. And so Spotify's like, yeah, we're kind of lefties, but you know what? We really enjoy the, the millions of dollars of revenue and money that Joe Rogan makes us. So uh, see you later, uh, Neil Young. Well, it's just one of those things. Apparently, the Spotify audience does not need Neil Young around anyhow. Anyhow, it's interesting that people continuously ragging Joe Rogan and want him taken down. But uh, let me let me know your thoughts. Do you think Joe Rogan should be taken down because he's willing to talk to everybody? And I mean, he's bringing in experts mixed in with some comedians. So maybe maybe people think that the people he's talking to are just comedians or vice versa. The experts are the comedians are experts. You know, who knows? Anyhow, those are my thoughts. What are yours?